I think it was a good finish, a good run first from Messi, then a good finish, and then following, and so brilliant. Does he surprise you at all? He's gone past 50 games and he's never, well, he seems to always be fit. It must be ideal for you. Uh, he isn't fit in this moment, <laughs> but he is determined to play. And I, I say in the week, he is an example. But I have to say the same to Harry Maguire, also not top fit, but on the bench. And in the last 10 minutes, he came on. But that is the mentality we need in this moment. 15 Premier League clean sheets now, and you've had to change the defensive line. How important are your defenders, particularly Shaw and Lindelof at this moment? Uh, they do very well. And uh, Shaw likes it to play centre-half, but of course it's a, a, a schooled uh, full-back that he's doing very well inside, but then yeah, you need cooperation because it's a back four with midfield. It's always about communication to get a good organisation, and they do very well. They play uh, very good together, and we're happy with that. But always, also, I have to say, it's about the whole team be defending with 11. You've got six games left now in the Premier League. Um, it's look, it looks good in terms of qualification for the top four, but you still, I guess there's still a bit of work to be done. Don't get distracted. We have to go from game to game. Uh, all the games are tough. Thursday we go to Brighton. We had the experience uh, last week. You have to be really good if you want to get there the points, but that is, of course, the aim. Thanks very much, Eric. Cheers. Take care. It's the same as always, three points. And luckily, we, do, we, we can't get the points back from the, the last game against Tottenham that we should and we could have, uh, have a better result and, and get two more points from that game. Uh, but we had to, to put our focus on this game and do our best to win, and, uh, and we did it, and we got the three points today. The goal then, um, obviously it was a rebound, and it was quite an acute angle as well. What, what do you remember of it from your point of view? No, obviously, I... I saw I saw the shot coming. I, I knew that it could come from the keeper. He could leave the ball there because the pitch was really quick. Uh, it, it, it would be tough for him to, to grab the ball. And obviously, I just tried to come from behind the left back and, uh, and get my chance to, to score. Uh, I get a good a good shot on the ball. Obviously, a deflection that that made the ball bounce and go a little bit higher. And uh, anyway, uh, it's a, it hit the net and it's a goal. And I'm really happy for that. That's your seventh against Aston Villa, and their fans were giving you a bit of stick. That was a nice moment for you to go and celebrate in front of them. Uh, obviously, they they probably don't like to play against me, um, but it's is what it is. It's football. I am okay with that. They can they can enjoy the game in the way they want. Uh, I would prefer them to come and uh, support their players instead to be focused on me. But if they think it's better to be focused on me than their players, is okay. I don't mind at, at all. 1-0 is never quite enough, is it? But that's a 15th Premier League clean sheet and you've got quite a few defenders missing as well. So what would you say about the lads at the back? Oh, we, we know that we have people missing. Um, Age was not in his best condition and uh, he, he came to help us and, uh, and he came in, uh, at the end in the last few minutes to help the team, even not being uh, in the best form or fit enough to, to play. Uh, and after, I think, uh, Victor outstanding today for me, one of the best in the, in the pitch. Him and Casemiro for me, one of, two of the best of the team. But I think Diogo was incredible. Luke playing out of position again, unbelievable. Uh, Tyrell really good. And um, and David, as always, uh, we're really happy to keep clean sheets for him because um, we know how important it is for keepers. And obviously, the rest of the team did a really good performance. We could have got a little bit more goals, but uh, it's it's a tough it's a tough team to play against. They they, they are well organised. They have good patterns, and uh, and and it's ne never easy. But we get our result. Six. Premier League games left now. Uh, and it looks good in the top four, doesn't it? Still a bit of work to do. Yeah, yeah, still, still uh, some work to do. Obviously, we are in a great position. We are in the top four. Um, so we have to be there. We have to maintain our position and uh, and keep winning games to be in the Champions League next season because it's is what this cl this club deserves. These players deserve to play in this uh, kind of competitions in the playing against the best teams in the world. And we will give everything to be in the top four. Our aims is always to win trophies. And luckily, this this year our aims to win the Premier League is not there anymore, so we have to aim for the top four and uh, for the FA Cup final. Just finally, you've gone past 50 games again. You're never ill, you're never injured. How do you do it? Because this is, it's a relentless schedule, isn't it? No, obviously, it's. Uh, I'm, I'm happy to never be in, in, uh, in a condition that doesn't make me 
get out of games, but obviously uh, I had, I had a, a knock in the in the semi final that is still hurt a little bit, but uh, I can play. Uh, I can still help the team, and uh, when the manager needs me, I, I will be available for the team to help because I think it's important to 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 me to to play as more as much as I can. Uh, but uh, obviously, I want to try to be in the, in the best condition and try to not get ill and uh, and everything like that. Trying to eat healthy enough to be in the best conditions to play every game. Congratulations! Thank you very Cheers, much. Mate. Thanks for being clear uh, in terms of that buffer between themselves and fifth and Manchester United nine with a game in hand. Is that third and fourth done for you? I think that the nail is in the coffin for all the teams that are chasing. Liverpool will be watching that today thinking, if we beat Tottenham, can we chase them down? But with Manchester United and Newcastle United winning today, I think that might seal the deal. I've got to totally agree with Michael. I think it's over in respect of the Champions League places. So for Newcastle, you know all about those supporters up there. It would be a third Champions League campaign only in their history, what kind of achievement and what kind of excitement will that be for you? I think it's have? massive for everyone over there because after the time that they were not investing and uh, the new owners investing a lot of uh, money, Eddie Howe is doing a great, great job. So I think everybody will be over the moon, like you say in English, <laughs> and uh, they will be around the city celebrating every day. Yeah, you, you know as well the, mm -hmm. the place of, of Newcastle for, for Eddie Howe to provide Champions League football from where they were when he took over second bottom? Yeah, I think I was sort of growing up when, I, when Newcastle was, was we were on this crest of a wave uh, prior, of course, in, in Rafa's time and my time. The club were in a little bit of a lull, as Rafa said, not much investment, etc. Um, however, now they're back in the big time and it's looking virtually certain that they're going to be in the Champions League. And with the promise and with the excitement and the potential of maybe going even one step further in the future, let's not uh, run before we can walk. But we saw this type of situation with Manchester City a decade or so ago. Um, and now, in fact, longer than that, but now you, you, you see Newcastle emerging and going probably at a quicker pace than we all thought. And Manchester United virtually there as well. That means they can freshen up, relax, ready to stop Man City doing the treble in the FA Cup final. <laughs> I don't think that's going to help them. <laughs> 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 They're still in a great position.